Hi, this is Shadi and today it's going to be a short one. Now, uh, I've discussed a lot of judokas throughout the 20th century and this century and the 19th century, but when it comes to the elephant in the room or the obvious, I still haven't done that and that is Vladimir Putin's judo or President Vladimir Putin's judo. We all know that he's a two-time Russian president, former prime minister and uh, KGB officer and when it comes to judo he started very early in life and he has competed and also he is skilled in sambo so there's a few things that uh, people ask about is that why does he not represent sambo something that's more uh, his own country and two what's his ranking in judo and is he legit so when it comes to his upbringing in judo he, he first he was born in 1952 so He's gonna turn uh, 68 in just a few days. Um, so, st someone that's still in his age doing these nagekomi, that's, that alone is very impressive. So, he started uh, Sambo before starting Judo at the age of 14. And then a year later, he started Judo. Um, and then after that, he started to compete uh, in Leningrad. He was winning competitions and then took third place at the Russian Junior Nationals. And then when he became a senior or uh, 20 and above, at least that's how it is in France, he became the champion of Leningrad. So later on, he joined the KGB and it was required that uh, they would have some sort of combat sports training. So he was advised to just keep training in uh, both Judo and Sambo. So uh, at the age of 40, he became uh, fourth dan but when it comes to his ranking currently uh, he recently around uh, 2012 got his eighth dan and he became the first russian to ever been awarded eighth dan and also he, he got his seventh dan in 2009 but his sixth dan he got it actually at the kodokan or the red and white belt in the year 2000 so back when he was prime minister so his ranking is pretty much uh, legit and when it comes to uh, choosing s judo over sambo he simply says that it's his favorite sport and uh, also he got he was awarded master of sports in both judo and sambo in the soviet union and uh, not only that but when it comes to his love for judo he was uh, also able to co-author a book about judo and it's called uh, judo history theory practice and also the book was turned into a film called judo with vladimir putin so you can find the book on amazon uh, very easily but it's very expensive so uh, when it comes to judo he is very well legit uh, as far as ranking just the fact that he is the first russian to ever got the eighth dan and also being awarded the red and white belt from the kodokan and also having a political career on the side that's pretty much very impressive now i'm not saying i like him or i agree with his politics or this or that this is not about that because this channel is not about this subject uh, whatsoever but when it comes to you know uh being in something like political world and uh growing up in the cold war and during turmoil times i believe something like judo does help it strengthens your character and also helps you become more assertive you see we talk a lot about dominant positions and dominate the posture so on and so forth but that stuff can easily translate outside the mat everything you do in judo can translate outside the mat i'm sure a lot of you uh, instinctively bow to someone to show gratitude outside the mat it just happens and a lot of the thought process the strategies how you try to observe things when things doesn't work out and then you study them and try to develop a strategy to in order to conquer it so on and so forth i believe that judo is something that's very important uh for example the book of five rings uh the art of war and a lot of these uh, books you can see that a lot of the concepts that we use in order to get ahead uh succeed and also progress they, they are found in martial arts that we do 
So I believe that something like Judo truly helped him to strengthen his character, become more assertive. Now I'm not gonna say he's good or bad, and also the media plays a huge role, so you cannot believe everything. So I, this is not about this uh, particular subject, but when it comes to being like this man that everyone knows that he has a strong character and he's like uh, really firm as a mountain, uh, I'm sure that martial arts training that he had played a huge role. So if you have anything else uh, to add to this uh, little small piece of uh, judo presentation about Vladimir Putin, let me know down below. Also consider supporting me on Patreon. I have a few videos already out for the patrons only. Uh, like I said, if you have anything else to add, share it down below. This was Shady and thank you for listening.